Hi guys, it is Chrissy K and welcome to my first impression on the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Girl Foundation. This is supposed to be a 24 hour foundation and it has a, a radiant glowy finish. So it says um, lasting glow foundation, never dull, never greasy. Um, radiant finish, 24 hour coverage, medium, 24 hour, last 24 hours, medium coverage and an air light texture. And let's see, a pro tip is to shake well onto skin in a rolling motion. So we're gonna shake it. This foundation comes in like 12 shades and I believe that it retails for like $12. Now it is a spinoff of the L'Oreal Impalable Pro Matte and I absolutely love this foundation. This is like one of my go-to foundations for the summer at the drugstore. And now we have this one because I am all about my glow but I just don't like to look dewy and greasy. So um, I'm gonna head and apply this and see how I feel about it. It is a little watery. That's, that's, the other one is really thick and creamy, but this is a different finish. So it says you're supposed to apply it with your fingers. So I'm just gonna. So, so far it's medium coverage. It's, um, it's not too heavy. I guess you can let it dry and layer it. I can still see my freckles. My skin does look like radiant. It looks like I added like, um, I'll add like some of my Becca, um, like highlighter, my liquid highlighter and inside of it, my foundations normally to get this look, but right now I have this look without it. I'm going to let it dry, but so far the coverage looks good. I'm using the shade. 209 and I like it um, I don't have any complaints about it it's a really good coverage it's affordable it's a dewy glow and if it does what it's supposed to do and last 24 hours like this is all I need this is a really like a go-to this could be one of my new go-to every day for a lighter coverage and I guess I can layer up in coverage in the areas that I like so what I am gonna do today is I'm gonna finish my face I normally do this and then I powder my face because I like that full coverage look but today I'm only going to add powder to the places that I add concealer. I'm just literally gonna apply some blush, some bronzer, concealer, setting powder underneath my eyes. And we're gonna see how this lasts. Um, and I'm just gonna check out, check in with you guys throughout the day and let you know how this is holding up and let you know if this is something that I would recommend. So if you wanna see how this foundation actually lasts, keep watching and I'll be back with updates. Okay, so this is my first update. It's about 7.30. I will say it was maybe about two o'clock when I did this. So it's a little over five hours. I am still very dewy and luminous and I did go ahead and apply my makeup on. Um, I didn't use any um, like setting powder. I usually do like full coverage. I'll apply like a powder on top of my foundation to make it last because I don't want any shine. But right now I'm really dewy. The only thing I did apply was I applied some bronzer, blush, and um, highlighter, but like, you know, powder highlighter. But other than that, like when I powder my whole face, I didn't powder my face. And so, so far, so good. What's holding up? Let me see. Look in the mirror. Nothing has started to separate and it looks pretty good. It looks pretty like dewy and luminous still. And it doesn't look like too shiny. Um, Actually, my nose is a little shiny, but like that's my problem area. I also didn't use any primer today too, um, cause I just wanted to see what it does. Normally I use a primer and I usually like mattify my nose so that I don't have the shine, but mm, other than that, so far I cannot complain. Um, I'm probably gonna do one more update tonight before I go to bed, just so I can let you know how it's holding up. And um, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, so it's about 20 after midnight and this is literally like my full face from all day. I got a little shine. I could probably blot or add some powder, but I haven't done anything. I think I look um, dewy, luminous, a little oily. Being too dewy and too luminous will have you looking a little crazy, a little shiny. I do feel like had I primed my skin, I meant to like prime one half of my face, but I, I forgot. 
I think had I primed my skin or even applied powder, like actually what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna apply some powder to see if that'll work, just to kind of figure out if that will last all day. Honestly, like applying the tiniest bit of powder made the hugest difference. One place I'm still shining is where I put the highlighter on purpose. And so honestly, I feel like it's a great, I feel like I genuinely, I like this product. I, I endorse it as Chrissy K approved. And it's something that I will be using this summer. Now that I know how to use it, I know it works well with a powder. Next time I wear it, I'm gonna wear it with a primer. I'm about 12 hours in. So um, with that being said, most people don't even wear their makeup for 12 hours. It's like a work day and maybe a few places after and I still look good. And now after applying this powder, I still feel like I'm gonna look good later. Like if I had somewhere else to go, but being that it's midnight, I'm not going anywhere but to bed. But you guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed already and you like videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. But until then, I will see you in my next video. Mwah.